The simultaneous explosions of thousands of Hezbollah pagers and other communication devices raise many questions, and some of those are starting to get answers. On the method used, a Lebanese security official told the AFP that explosives were inserted in the devices, PENT. This material is very powerful, yet relatively easy to conceal. Hezbollah is extremely security cautious. So they also have, you know, bomb sniffing um, dogs uh, and they do security checks. It's believed a few grams of PETN were integrated along with a circuit board into the pager. The model used is an AR-924 from Taiwanese brand Gold Apollo. The company immediately denied being involved. It said a factory based in Budapest, BAC Consulting, was authorized to manufacture the pagers. But there is no factory nor warehouse at the company's address. The Hungarian government confirms BAC is a trading intermediary with no manufacturing or operational site in Hungary. The, quote, reference devices have never been in Hungary. The company, created two years ago, has one employee, its general manager. The walkie-talkies that were targeted on Wednesday had the logo of a Japanese brand, ICOM, but the company said it stopped producing the model 10 years ago. As far as who is behind these attacks, the operating mode and the target point to one country, Israel, although it has not claimed responsibility.